It's kitten season, and with a female cat being able to produce as many as 18 kittens in a single season, it's no wonder why the shelters are full. And we're having them dropped off uh, at the shelter. We're finding, uh, having calls from them being boxes dropped off on trails in the middle of streets. It's, it's terrible, and uh, we're getting a little bit overwhelmed. We're handling it at the moment. Um, anywhere from 10 to 30 kittens we've been getting a week uh, for the last three weeks now. Kittens are often too young to stay at the shelter and are placed in temporary foster homes. There's a great need in our community for foster homes. It's an important commitment, but it's not a big one. It doesn't take a lot of space. It doesn't take a lot of time. It doesn't take a lot of work. It's a whole lot of fun. I don't watch TV anymore. I come in and watch kittens. If you're addicted to kittens like I am, fostering is the best thing to do. We really do need to build out our foster base. Um, we have a wonderful network of foster families that foster not only kittens, but adult cats who might have medical problems or recovering from surgery, and of course dogs as well. Um, so we'd really encourage people who are uh, interested in being a foster family to come down and fill out a, a foster adoption form, and uh, we can set them up, and, and when the need arises, we can, we can give you a call, and hopefully uh, you can help us that way. It helps catnap in the SPCA tremendously so that these kittens can grow up, learn to be proper socialized family pets. And the beauty is before they actually go into adopted homes, they go back to the SPCA, they get all their shots, they get fixed. So they're good and healthy. Kittens are, are really quite easy to adopt out. The other problem we have is when our kitten adoptions go up, um, our adult cats are being overlooked. Um, and of course, we have quite a few. We probably have 40 or 50 adult cats in the shelter at the moment who are lovely and, and mature and looking for a quiet home, younger ones looking for a more active home, uh, as well as the kittens. If you're thinking about heading down to the shelter just to play with the kittens, please don't. It's not something they allow. We are discouraging people from coming down to just come and pet the kittens. Kittens. If you are interested in, in adopting a kitten, uh, you can come down and fill out an application uh, to adopt. And once that's been approved, you're more than welcome to go into our kitten area and look at the kittens. Uh, but you won't be able to come down and, and, and just play with them as cute as they are um, for their own health and welfare. Adoption and fostering definitely help with the kitten season crisis. But the ultimate that's solution nice. would be to reduce the number of kittens being born. We're always we're trying to make people aware that the need of spaying and neutering their animals um, for low income people that can afford it, we have a program here which is called the SNP program which can help you uh, and you can call the shelter uh, for that as well. There are a number of cat rescues overwhelmed with the kitten season. Check with your local shelters to find out about adoption and fostering. In Nanaimo for Shaw TV Channel 4, I'm Kelly Murphy.